There's few dishes that are close to my heart and this next recipe is one of them. My mom used to cook that for us when we were a kid and I love it. It's stuffed tomato with sausage mix. So all you have to do is to get some beautiful, good sized fresh tomatoes, ripe but a bit firm. Cut a little bit of the bottom so it just stays straight. All right, when you've done that, what you need to do is cut the top of the tomato. Make sure you keep the green on top of it and save it for later as a lid. So the next step basically is to scoop out the inside. With a pointy teaspoon, just dig in all around it first and then fill the bottom with your spoon without breaking it. I can now put this aside and work on the mince. So I've got onion and garlic here, which I'm gonna fry slightly until it's nice and soft. So I've got a bigger pork, a bit of veal mince, some onion and garlic. And basically what I'm creating here is like, a little bit like a sausage mince. Crack an egg. Put a bit of salt, of course. I love using pork because it's got a lot of fat in it. And pepper. And to this, I'm gonna bring some chopped parsley and a bit of breadcrumbs just to hold it together. So yeah, I've got the garlic and onion that's cooked very slowly in olive oil that I'm gonna put in the mince and mix straight away. Here we go. So when that mince is ready, all you have to do is stuff the tomatoes. So get a spoon, push the mince right in, even a little bit over the top like this, because as the tomato is gonna cook and the mince is gonna cook, the mince is gonna shrink in a little. Lid on. I don't know what you think already, but I think even before cooking, it looks quite nice. Imagine all this beautiful meat, onion, garlic, tomato juices, all cooking together. All I need to do now, drizzle with olive oil. So that's going in the oven for 30 minutes at 180 degrees. It's just smelling so good in here. I'm 10 years old again. I can smell my mom's cooking. It's in the oven and it's ready. Oh, look at this. With that beautiful juice at the bottom of the tray, which you need to scoop out and then drizzle. And Let's cut now because I'm not gonna eat it. 